All right, this is Ian Jones, and uh, we've been working on this problem. There's, oh, we there's, the there's, point, there's, there's a scene. The, the scene's board. retreated to the corner. The, 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 well, you should have filmed the board after uh, you wrote on it. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, no. Okay, so, so the problem, it says that among all simple closed curves, among all simple closed curves in the plane, oriented counterclockwise, we need to find the one in which the work done, f of x, y, is equal to one-fourth, x squared y plus one third y, y to the third i plus xj is the greatest. And, you know, we have to justify our answer or no credit will be given for this problem without a clear written explanation. So, so, so we've been working on this for, I don't know, maybe like three hours. Um, at this point, here's, here's what we've worked, here's what we've developed. <laughs> this, is weird, this is the answer. This is definitely an answer. Follow, the only problem is there's a rotational tendency. This, oh. this isn't very accurate, these little lines right here. It's more like they're going this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. You follow that. You follow the curl, right? You want to do the most work in a closed path. So in this case, it's going to be an ellipse. It's got to be this little ellipse. And we came, out, we came up with it in so many different ways. You don't need to graph it. I mean, you can. That would help. But that would, very, that would definitely help. But the curl tells you analytically um, the rotational tendency. You just follow but that follow and you do path, the maximum work. It's going to be the conservative path. But how? Oh, because of this thing? Yes. It's, it's never going to be conservative. I don't know why. <laughs> There's no such thing as a conservative path because why there are only conservative forces. So it's been going like this probably for the last three hours. Only one person says, "Oh, I got it," and then the next person forces. comes and they say, "Oh, I got and it." We go and come back. The work on the force zero. is zero. But there, so if you follow this path, the work is going to be zero. No, 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 no. This is the particle's path. The it force, is the force field, is not conservative. Oh, this so is it doesn't matter what path you take. There's no such thing as a conservative path. I think uh, there's only a conservative force. But our force given is not... Yeah, if the force is, not force is not conservative, then the work down on the path won't be zero. Won't be zero. Yeah, see, here's, where, here's where it stops being fun, see. They yeah, yeah, just yeah. repeat the same thing over and over. Right. And then this guy says he knows it. And then this, this guy says he knows it. And says, oh, I got it. Why don't I do this? Right, right. this and then the next guy goes, oh, wait, now I understand. And then it's completely this different. This is a conservative path, right? If we go in any kind of circle... The, the work done is going to be zero. zero. But in this case, I'm telling you, the, the, there's a rotational tendency. We've got force going this way, we've got force going this way, we've got force going this way, we've got force going that way. 